Hey everyone, and welcome back. In our last lesson, we built the foundation for success by focusing on the learning mindset. I hope you've had a chance to join our Discord community because you're going to be putting those how to ask a great question skills to you soon. If you haven't joined, the link is always in the description. We'd love to see you there. Today, we get to dive into the technology itself. We're going to answer fundamental questions. For example, what is workflow automation? What exactly is NNN? And what's the difference between self-hosting and NNN cloud? Okay, let's jump right into it. Well, in order to understand why a tool like NNN is so powerful, we first need to understand the problem it solves. So let's imagine a world without automation. Let's say you run a small business and you have a contact form on your website. A potential new customer, Jane, fills it out. What happens next manually? Well, first, you get an email notification. You stop what you're doing to open it. Secondly, you open up your customer list, which might be a Google Sheet or a CRM. Thirdly, you manually copy Jane's name email and message from your inbox and paste it into the spreadsheet. Fourth, you switch over to Gmail to write her an email, something like thanks for reaching out. And finally, you might open up Slack to send a message to your sales team saying something like, hey, we just got a new lead. That one single lead just took you five or six manual steps across four different applications. Now, what are the problems with this? Firstly, it's incredibly time consuming. That might have been five minutes of your time. If you get 10 leads a day, that's almost an hour of your day just copying and pasting. Secondly, it's very error prone. Did you just accidentally misspell Jane's name when you pasted it? Or did you copy the wrong email address? These small mistakes can cost you customers. And thirdly, it just doesn't scale. 10 leads a day is manageable. 100 leads a day is impossible you'd need to hire someone just to handle data entry. The process itself becomes the bottleneck to your growth. This is the problem that workflow automation solves. Automation is simply the practice of teaching software to perform these multi-step repetitive tasks for you. And NNN is a tool that allows you to do exactly that. The best way to think of NNN is like a set of digital Lego blocks. Each application you use, Gmail, Google Sheets, Slack, or Stripe, is a block. NNN gives you the power to connect these blocks in any order you want to build a process, or what we call a workflow. So, in our example, the workflow would be, when a new form is submitted, i.e. that's the trigger, you add a row to Google Sheets, then send an email from Gmail, and finally post a message in Slack. You build this workflow once, switch it on, and it works for you 24-7, instantly and without any errors. That's the power of NNN. So what exactly can you build with NNN? Well, you can build anything you want, really. For example, marketing automations. For example, you can sync leads from Facebook ads to your CRM. You can build sales operations workflow. You can automatically generate invoices when a customer pays you on Stripe. You can create a workflow for social media management. So you can automatically post your new blog post articles uh, to Twitter or LinkedIn. And you can build workflows for personal productivity. For example, you can get a daily summary of the weather and your calendar sent to you on Telegram. If a task involves moving information between different digital applications, chances are you can automate it with NNN. Okay, so now you know what NNN is and why it's so powerful. The next question is, where does it run? Well, NNN gives you two main options for this, self-hosted or NNN cloud. Let's use an analogy. Think about a house. Self-hosting is like building your own house. You're given the blueprints, i.e. the NNN software, and you are responsible for everything else. You have to buy the land, i.e. a server, lay the foundation, 
i.e. installing the operating system, and handle all the construction, plumbing, and security yourself. The pros are you have ultimate control and privacy. The cons are that you are responsible for all the maintenance, security, and updates. It requires technical expertise. The cloud option, on the other hand, is like renting a fully managed apartment. You just sign up, get the keys, and the building management, that's the NNN team, handles all the maintenance, security, and utilities for you. It's ready to go from day one. The pros are that it's incredibly easy to start and there's zero maintenance for you. But the con is that it might be more expensive if you're running millions of workflow steps and you have slightly less control over the underlying server. So which one's for us? Well, we're gonna be using the cloud option. And the reason for that is very simple. We are here to learn about how to design and build automations. We are not here to learn server administration. The cloud version lets us skip the complicated setup and jump straight into the fun part. It removes a huge barrier and ensures everyone can follow along, regardless of their technical background. Okay, so let's quickly recap. Manual repetitive work is slow, error prone, and doesn't scale. Uh, you learned that workflow automation solves this and NNN is a powerful tool that acts like digital Lego blocks uh, to build these automations. You also learned the difference between self-hosted and cloud and why we're gonna be using the cloud version for this course. Okay, it's time for your assignment. And it's very simple. Uh, simply go to nnn.io and sign up for a free cloud account. You don't need to build anything yet, but it gets you ready for the next lesson where we'll do a deep dive into the NNN interface. If you have any questions during the sign-up process, or just want to say, I'm ready for the next step, uh, where should you go? You guessed it, go to our Discord community. Okay, thanks for watching. And in the next video, like I mentioned before, we'll take a first look inside the NNN interface and get you comfortable with the editor. Uh, I'll see you there. Thanks for watching.